the citizens of Slovak AK have been under attack by the evil queen who zaps him with the laser eyeballs. Pew, 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 pew. In comes a swarm of the cars. Pew, 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 pew. Gotcha. Oh, no. Oh, the swarm of, the swarm of cars is following our flying dog. What will we do? But who is it? It's Super KK to save the day. Ah, uh, that's it. I've had it. I give up. <gasps> oh no! I hear a cry of distress from someone in, well, distress. Or is it a troubling cry of someone? Nope. It is a cry of distress by someone in trouble. Nailed it. <laughs> What seems to be the problem, noble citizen? Nope, nuh uh. Go away. Resistance is futile, noble citizen. Super KK is here to save the day. KK, I do not have time for all of your crazy shenanigans that you're gonna hey, try to there, pull. Hey, noble citizen. Shh, it's all gonna be okay. It's all gonna be okay. Shh. Would you stop petting me, please? Sorry. First a paint problem, and then I gotta get petted like a puppy in the window, saying, how much is that doggy in the window there? Well, gotta... Wait, wait, did I hear there's a problem with paint? Yes, okay, I can't paint. There, I said it. What nonsense. Oh no, sense, plenty of sense. I tried, I failed, I give up there. PB, anyone can paint. Not I. Uh-huh. Nope. Yes. KK. Yes. KK, don't do it. Yes. KK. KK, I can't paint. Okay. I, I'm tired of all of these uh, dumb brushes. <gasps> Ugh. No sense in killing trees and hurting the environment. Oh no. And I don't need any more of it. Well, I guess that's it, really. Just the brushes okay. and the papers. Would you, would you be a deer and? Pick up a few of those, uh, yeah, knock them the, right. The papers? Yeah, just right set them right, the right there. Okay. Would be good, yeah. Well, uh, uh. <sighs> PB, I don't understand. What seems to be the problem? You seem very discombobulated. Discombobulated? I guess you could say that. Okay. You seem very discombobulated. <sighs> it's my father. Your father made you discombobulated? No, it's his birthday tomorrow. Oh! Oh, and he's upset about getting older, and his upsetness has made you upset. No. No? No, I was painting a picture of him for his birthday. Oh, 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 oh and the, the paints. No, oh. Oh, uh, the, the brushes. No, I, I'm sorry, I'm coming up empty, PB. What, what, I don't understand what the problem is. Oh, okay, KK. Okay. Uh, I bought myself some paints there. Uh-huh. And uh, I started to paint it. I realized that I couldn't paint a picture of my father the way he looks. Sure you can. No, I literally can not. He has a purple nose. Like yours, <laughs> which is very nice, by the way. I've always found it rather strapping. Oh, you think so? I always thought it was a little bit too flashy. I was thinking of maybe having it dyed when I got a little bit older. Oh, no, no. It suits you. Really? Mm hmm. Mm. Uh, oh, right. So I went to paint his nose there, and I don't have any purple paint. I've got uh, red and yellow and blue and white and black. Oh. <laughs> hey. What is so funny? This is no laughing matter. How? This is a disaster. My present is ruined, and now it's too late to get another present for my father. Never fear, citizen. Super KK is here to rescue you. Your painting will not be ruined. KK, I think I know when a painting is ruined, and a painting of my father with no nose on it is a ruined painting. That's it. I'm finished. Kaput. I've had it. No. No, no, no worries, PB. I know exactly how to help you. Exactly. I learned all about it at school. You learned about my father's nose at your school? I don't think that qualifies for Alex standards. No, silly. I learned about primary colors and secondary colors. Primary? And secondary. C 
see, you can make the colors you need with the colors that you have. Purple. I need purple, and I don't have any purple. Are you even listening to a word that I'm saying? But PB, purple is a secondary color. I don't care if it's a hereditary color. I don't have it. No, no. See, the primary colors are red, yellow, and blue. Yeah, well, I got those, dear. Yeah, and when you mix a primary color with another primary color, you get a secondary color. That is not true. Yes, it is. Prove it. OK. Welcome to my art studio, PB. Uh, 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 what the? What was that? I said prove it and you just took off running out of the room. Who does that? Where are we? Welcome to my art studio. I don't remember this room being here. Sure you do. It's my art studio. It's where I make all my best arts. Your best arts? Now, the first thing you want to make sure you do is have all the supplies that you need, like your brushes and your paints and a canvas or some kind of paper to paint on. Maybe play some light music. And Harold. Harold? Of course. Harold the hippo. I can't do my best odds without my best friend. Oh, cheese whiz. The next thing you need to do is make sure you cover everything. My mom makes me cover the floors and the walls and wear the special paint smock. She says, you're my little Jackson Pollock. Whatever that means. I think he was a tidy gentleman who covered all of his furniture in plastic. No, KK, Jackson Pollock was not a- The next thing you need to make sure that you <sighs> do is to get a container of water. Now, uh, the, this is not to drink. And the water is so that you can clean out your brushes in between colors. Now, it will get murky and brown, so you want to use an old container. Not something like your mother's china tea set. I learned that the hard way. Where did you get water? There is no sink in this room. Paper towels are also helpful in case you have a spill or you need to clean off your brush. Where are you getting these things? And now we paint. Now it's best to think about all of your favorite things about your dad while painting him. First of all, we need to paint his fur. And he's red like you. Red is a primary color. So we just grab our handy dandy red paint and a little on your brush. And we're going to make some squibbly little fur lines in the shape of his head. Like this. Yeah. Good. Okay, let's see. I need one of those paint mixer things. I don't see one of those. And are you using small or big brushes? Then you want to paint his eyeballs. Now, does your dad have big, kind eyeballs, or does he have mean, scary ones? Ah, big ones. Okay, so we take some white and you make big, kind eyeballs. He has two of them. Some monsters only have one. Then we take a little bit of black. And we make the pupil. Those are very important things. Pupils. Don't forget, rinse out your brush. Oh, you're already painting. Okay, what colors do I need? I've got some red and some... What color are his eyelids? Yellow. Good, another primary color. So just take some yellow paint. And we're going to make some friendly half circles over the tops of his eyeballs. Friendly little eyelids. Yellow is a very friendly color, don't you think? Just like daisies. 
Huh? Oh, yeah, sure. Uh, am I supposed to squeeze the paints out onto something? I don't see anything. Now to... we get to the tricky part, the nose. Nose? Yep, and it's purple. Now remember, purple is a secondary color. And to make a secondary color, you have to mix two primary colors. So we take a little bit of the red and a little bit of the blue. We mix it together. If your purple is too dark, maybe you add a little bit more red so it's brighter. And voila! Purple! Uh, slow down there, Rob Boss. So we take our new purple color and make a friendly oval just below his eyeballs. Ovals are fun shapes. They're like circles if Harold sat on them and squished them. What, what, what's that about, Harold? Next, we give him a big friendly smile. We just take some black and make the bottom half of a circle. It's like, it's like when you eat a pizza and you cut it for the first time. Why like a half circle in the bottom? Good. Uh, that was red and blue, you said, is that right? Now, does your dad have a mustache? Yeah, that's right. Mine too, what <laughs> coinky dink. So, we take some black and some white and mix it together to make gray. And then, we give a big, curly, swirly mustache. Big and friendly. Like a cowboy cherub from the old west, he twirls his mustache in one hand, and tips his hat with the other as he passes you and says, Howdy, ma'am. Wait, so I mix the red and blue to make a cowboy pizza? Then we get a little more wet on our brush and finish off the bottom of his mouth. Wait, we're back to red and we use yellow and blue and made purple. Let's see, what does that leave us? Now, what is your dad's favorite color? Green and orange. Green and orange? <laughs> Great! Those are the other two secondary colors. <laughs> I love using all the colors because they look so good together. So, to make green, you mix blue and yellow. And to make orange, you mix red and yellow. Okay, when do I do the eyeballs? Then we'll take a little bit of the green, and we're gonna make a big D over here on this side of his head. I'm gonna take a little bit of the orange, make a big A in the middle, and then we'll get a little more green again. And we'll make the last D. And that spells dad. And ta-da, we did it. We painted a picture of your dad using primary and secondary colors. Got it. Great, let's see how you did. What's that now? Let's see your finished painting. We're finished? Of <laughs> course, cool, silly. PB, that's just his nose. Yippers, and it's perfect. Thank you, KK. And now, if you'll excuse me, I'll be taking this. <laughs> PB, that's my painting. I can keep it secret if you can. Uh, P, wait, you, you forgot to clean up your workstation. Oh.